everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am Simply Brentley. Don't forget to get your energy in and like, comment, and subscribe. For all of your manifestation needs as well as the personals, head on over to my website, energyllc.com. The link will be in the description box below. All right, all right, all right. Holy Father, angels, ancestors, speak through me. If I reach one person and one person alone, which I know I will, please and thank you. This message is for all of my Leos, all of my Leos. Let me go ahead and grab for all of my Leos. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, so somebody has been thinking about you in a very sexual way. Somebody has definitely been wanting you. They have been yearning for you. And they have definitely wanted to come forth. So let me go ahead and give my Romance Angels deck to see what we have. Whenever I was just shuffling i saw very soon so let's see what is this okay of course you want to fall on the floor what is it let go of control issues allow this situation to unfold naturally okay so maybe somebody um your counterpart was very much so wanting to control this situation or you take a high resonate was wanting to control this situation but it just wasn't working reconciliation Somebody wants to reconcile with you. Somebody wants to reconcile with you. Um, so for sure, for sure. Let's see what else we have here. So like whenever I was doing that, a lot of the cards that I had beside me, which are, is a Kipper deck, they fell over. So let's see what they what fell over. We have sad news, receiving a gift, good lady, and pleasant letter. Okay. And the sad news is right over letter, uh, letting go of control issues. Okay, so because of this person having to feel like they needed to be in control all the time, there was something that wasn't expected. There was something that really didn't work out to their benefit. Um, but in this reconciliation that this person wants to have, they definitely um, may have had some problems with some finances in their career. So that could have definitely been keeping them stuck or stagnant. Um, that could have definitely been keeping them away from wanting to approach you. But this person is thinking about you know, something very, um, very much so like if you have ever like spent the night with this person or anything like that, they're thinking about some type of moment and something that you did that was so small that you probably don't even realize you did, but it was like so beautiful. And that's the moment they, they realized they were in love with you. Right. Then here we go. This could be the one. So you already met the, the romantic partner you seek. So this person is realizing that maybe before, I'm definitely realizing, realizing that they were um, withholding and they didn't. We have the moon right here. Yeah, we have emotions, right? They weren't able to effectively communicate because they were so much in their head and there was so much anxiety and so much betrayal that this person faced in the past. They didn't want to let their guard down and really show you like that they really loved you. They loved the fuck out of you, but they couldn't really express that shit, right? Then we have um, reconciliation here twice, right? And then the Ten of Swords. So this person definitely had like some type of backstabbing situation that they did to you. And now they're wanting to surrender and go ahead and pick this up and go ahead and watch, show you that they're show you, show motherfuckers show you that they're walking away from, running away from, driving away from, flying away from all the situations that no longer crawling a fucking way from. The situations that no longer serve them. Because um, it's been driving them crazy. You hear that? It's been driving them crazy being in separation from you, not being able to touch you, not being able to feel you, not being able to truly connect with you because that energy is irreplaceable, baby. That energy is irreplaceable and that passionate connection that you had, they have tried to find you and other people. They have um, definitely sought um, loving elsewhere, right? But they have not been able to see anything that even comes close to you. That even motherfucking comes close to you. So this person knows that there's some things that they, they have hidden in the past. Um, and, and they're wanting to definitely come forth and show you how the fuck they really feel. They're wanting to come... Um, that's the motherfucking truth. Ace of Swords. They're wanting to come forth um, and give you some mental clarity to work some uh, situation out. To see where the fuck y'all can go from here. To see where we can lead, like where the situation leads from here. And this person stays up in their head. So they have to um, get in their full energy to be able to go ahead and just 
you know, no holds, no holds bar type conversation, letting your motherfucking guard down and just understanding that they have to take a leap of faith no matter, you know, what the outcome to just put their heart the fuck out there so you can really know that they, that, that, you know, this is for you. So you can really know that this person really cares. So you can really understand the reason why this person was withdrawing from you. So you can really understand the reason why it didn't work out in the past. The reason why there was separation. The reason why everything, right? The reason why all this shit happened or unfolded the way the fuck it did. There has to be an in-depth conversation, right? And I had that in one of my reason readings that I did not too long ago. That a conversation is definitely needed, right? Um, because this person knows that they have so much love for you and they haven't been able to express it effectively. Then we have the six of wands. They definitely see you win winning. They definitely see um, you progressing. They definitely see you're very gifted, right? And they're definitely in a lot of pain, loss, regret, hurt, and dissatisfaction for how this situation unfolded, for how things happen, for how, you know, things didn't happen, and for how you can just expand and learn and um, definitely grow in... Work on the relationship and understand each other and how you want to be loved and how you want to be treated and how you want to have this love thing reciprocated back to you, right? But they do see the Ten of Cups with you. They do see a happy family, happy relationship. They do see satisfaction with you. They do see a good partner in you. They do see good fortune with you. They see all of that. They see all of that, Leo's. Because you're a very strong person and they see all of that and they really want to show you who the fuck they are for real, for real. Not put that fake phony shit on and definitely just be real and honest and, and um, you know, unpeel those layers and, and just being able to express effectively and getting letting that guard down and getting everything out. All right, all right, all right. For all of my Leos, don't forget to get your energy in and like, comment, and subscribe. For all of your manifestation needs as well as for personals, head on over to my website, energyllc.com. The link will be in the description box below. As always, peace, love, and namaste.